The second half of the school year now underway, which has been nothing short of abnormal for students and teachers. Tonight, Amy Steigerwaldy is looking into what has to happen across the state for schools to fully reopen. As frontline workers continue to receive the COVID-19 vaccine, teachers across Ohio are waiting for their turn while they continue navigating virtual and hybrid learning. Now, as it stands right now, only people who work in hospitals EMS personnel and those who work and live in nursing homes are able to receive the vaccine here in Ohio. Those who work in K-12 schools have been put in Category 1B to receive the vaccine, meaning they are next. However, officials with the Ohio Federation of Teachers say more planning needs to be done. Making it a precondition oversimplifies the issues that impact schools opening in full face-to-face -face mode. One of the big factors when it comes to reopening schools completely in person, how many staff members get the vaccine? The Ohio Federation of Teachers says should only 50 to 60 percent get it, having everyone back in the building is a risk. The vaccine should not be the only thing that's being looked at whenever we're looking at reopening schools. We still think it's necessary for the sake of the students and community spread and for anyone who's not been vaccinated that we have the mask wearing, the safe distancing. Officials are hoping state leaders take community spread into consideration when it comes to giving the all clear to open back up. While administrators have these suggestions, ultimately an exact timeline for when the vaccine will become available for educators is still up in the air. We have not been given any details on what the distribution is going to look like. Right now, districts are beginning to get a feel for how many employees would get the vaccine, but ultimately no concrete data is available just yet. In Toledo, Amy Stagerwald, WTOL 11.